hey you guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to another video so today you guys i'm gonna do a small grocery haul i'm gonna do a sitting right here in my car y'all are gonna see me in this shirt um in a, a few videos because i'm filming a few videos today and they're all gonna be kind of like released to like one after the other so y'all are gonna see me in the same shirt so i went into walmart and i went into food depot i'm going to show you guys some things that i went and picked up really quickly first we're going to do let's do walmart first so I went in and I got some of this value pack fiber one brownie bars. I love snacking on these, you guys. When I want something sweet at night, this is typically what I like to go for, or I like to go for um, a yogurt bowl or some Halo Top ice cream. I don't have any. I should have got some, but that's okay. Um, the more I have, the more I'll eat. So I'm just so I just got these, and again. These are 70 calories, five net carbs, and two grams of sugar. And this is the brownie chocolate chip cookie one. And you get, I think you get 12 bars. Yeah, you get 12 bars in here. So I picked that up. I also picked up, you guys, some of this 12 pack, the Keebler Fudge Stripe Minis. I got these mostly for my son to go on his lunch. Um, well, okay, let me just, for those of you who are new, my son is 21, he does work um but he takes a lunch to work every day so he likes to have little snacks and stuff i'm talking like he's a, a six-year-old going to school right no he's 21 but he does like to take a snack with him in his lunch so i just got these and james likes to eat them too um i will not be eating them <laughs> but you know he does like to eat them james likes to eat them just a quick little snack this is a 12 pack keebler fudge stripe mini cookies for his lunch or whatever whatever I don't have any school age children for those of you who are new I have two children my son is 21 still lives with me he is working and my daughter is 24 she's in the military I'm a Navy mom she's married in the military and they live in Washington DC so it's just a little bit about me for those of you who are new okay so I did pick up this rice this is the American spice yellow rice the spanish style with saffron this is so good you guys and i like to have a big old thing of this because it's good as a matter of fact you're going to see this in a cook with me i'm going to be doing today i'm going to be making some of this rice so i got that i like these single serving nuts because y'all i am a nut fanatic like if i have a big thing in, of like cashews or peanuts or pistachios y'all i'm eating the whole thing and that that's that's not good for my weight loss journey that's just not good nuts are good for you but they can add up very quickly if you're sitting down watching tv and you're just shoving nuts in your mouth girlfriend that's that's just not that's not good so i like so i like to get the single serving because i don't have sober behavior when it comes to peanuts peanuts pistachios cashews I'm just eating them like, 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 like they're, they're, like they're air. So I got the sea salt in shell pistachios. And this is the, and this is all by Nut Harvest. And I got the salted whole peanuts. And I also got the sea salt whole cashews. These are my favorite. The cashews are my favorite. And then pistachios and the peanuts. So I have these, you guys, single serving. Actually, let me just rephrase that because these are not single serving. A serving size for, say, the, the cashews is two tablespoons. I'm not going to eat two tablespoons and put them away. I'm going to eat the whole thing. So the whole thing is 370 calories for the package. Um, you know, if you're counting calories or whatever. So, And then the peanuts is 170 calories for three tablespoons. There's four servings in here, so you can do the math. And the pistachios is... This is a serving size. Pistachios is 160 calories for the one. So eat them at your own risk. I love peanuts and cashews and all the thing. I just don't have no control when it comes to them. I'm just eating them all up. So I got some salsa. This is a great value, thick and chunky salsa, the mild kind. I got some tortilla chips, but we like to have salsa with that. So I got that. This is also good at like spaghetti and tacos and the whole bit. So. I just got a small jar of the um, Great Value Salsa. I got an 18 count of eggs. All right, moving on. I got some of the Bold and Smooth Stoke Cold Brew Coffee. You guys know I like my yellow one, but they didn't have it. So I just got this one and this is the Unsweet Black. You know, I make my own like little brew or whatever. So I got that.
I also picked up some smoked turkey sausage. Again, you're gonna see that in my cook with me. So I got that as well. It's just the Hillshire Farm, Hillshire Farm brand. Most of the time I do beef, but I decided to go ahead and do turkey today. All right. Y'all, it is so gorgeous today. I mean, the sky is just not a cloud in the sky. It's beautiful. I got some heavy whipping cream. I need to make me up some more of my chia seed pudding. So I got that. I also got some of the unsweet vanilla almond milk. Pick that up as well. I like to put this also in my chia seed pudding. I'm gonna mix them up today as a matter of fact. Okay, so that's all for Walmart. Now I did go into Food Depot. Food Depot was a smaller haul. I'll show you what I got. I got a green and red bell pepper. I picked up a cabbage. Again, you'll see this in my cook with me. Because tonight for supper, y'all, I'm going to be making turkey wings with cabbage and sausage and probably some of that yellow rice. Delicious. Great, low-carb, delicious, flavorful meal. I can't wait. <laughs> I got some of these late July organic sea salt and lime tortilla chips. I like to snack on these a little bit. Not too much. You guys know I'm low-carb, but I do like to have one or two of these with some salsa. It's good. And you can fit some stuff in, you guys. Fit it in, you know? Don't deprive yourself of everything. I did that for a long time, y'all. Deprive myself of a lot of things. And I lost a lot of weight. I'm still losing weight. And I have to do a weight update video, too, as a matter of fact. I haven't done one of those in a while with you guys. So I got to do a weight update video. Soon. I'll get to that soon. And last but not least, you guys, I did get two things of turkey wings I'm going to make for dinner tonight. I had a hell of a time finding turkey wings, but I did find them, so... I got two bags of those. And you guys, that is it for my little car grocery haul here. So I'm about to go home, y'all, because I am, I want to get out before it got too hot. It is, what time is it? It's like my car is off on my phone. It's probably about nine o'clock right now. And y'all, it's supposed to be like 98, 99 all week long here in Georgia. And I just want to get out, get to the store and get what I needed to get. I'm gonna go home and make myself some coffee. Probably make myself something to eat because I'm in that store shopping and I was hungry, y'all. You should not shop while you're hungry. That's probably not the best thing to do, but I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna um, start another video. A cook with me, I'm also doing a, um, a vlog video today. So yeah, so they're gonna be kind of separate videos going on today. So anyway, you guys, that's probably going to do it for this video. Like I said, I'm going to go home and get myself together and start a separate, start a separate, um, a separate video. So that's what I got going on right now, you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, y'all give it a thumbs up for me. Put in the comments, you guys, what are you guys doing for dinner tonight? Are you cooking? Are you just going to put that, those turkey wings y'all going in the crock pot? Yes, ma'am, they're going in the crock pot because, again, I don't want to be turning the oven on. I mean, you know, let me just, I don't mind turning the oven on in the summertime. I really don't because the air is on, so I don't mind it. Um, it's just oh, getting, somebody leave their groceries in the car? Y'all, I wish I can show y'all. Somebody left their big old thing of um, chips. Like, you know, the big variety box of chips, y'all, they left them in the car. I, they must didn't see it. Wow. Mm -mm -mm. That's that's a heartbreaker right there. You ever done that? Left stuff in the cart or left a bag at the checkout or and you're like, wait a minute. Yeah, they left the whole big old thing of chips in the cart. Anyway, I'm finna drive off. I'm finna go. Because I'm pretty sure they're gonna be coming back for their chips. One lady, y'all, this was like two months ago. No, I was still living in my other apartment, and this lady I am in my, I'm putting my stuff in my car, <clears throat> coming out of Kroger, over by where I used to live. And I'm looking across, y'all, this lady put all her stuff in her bag, in her trunk, her groceries, got in the car, y'all, drove off and left her purse in the dang gum cart. I was like, oh my God, this lady just left her whole purse in the cart. I went over there, got the purse, took it to customer service. 
So I came back to my car. I'm like, I'm just going to sit here for a minute just to see if she come back to look for her purse. Y'all, she sure did. I'm sitting here and within like, oh my God, not even five minutes, that lady came back, looked in the car. I got out the car and I said, ma'am, I said, you left your purse in the car? She goes, yeah. I said, it's in customer service. Oh my God, she was just so grateful. Believe me, I know the feeling. I mean, I've never left my purse, but I could imagine because your whole life is in your purse. Your whole life is in your purse. If you're a lady, you know that. Anyway, they better come back for them chips. All right, y'all. So I'm going to go. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thumb it up for me. Uh, leave a question or a comment down below. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care and have a great day. Bye, y'all.